flying into a hurricane is not new. But flying a small, unmanned plane just above the ocean surface during a hurricane is very exciting news. NASA, NOAA, and the AAI Corporation have joined forces to make detailed observations into low areas of a hurricane too dangerous for manned aircraft. Learning more about hurricanes is very important, especially after the 2005 record-breaking season of 27 named storms. Scientists aren't sure how the rapid intensity change process works, but a hurricane can start as a minimal storm and grow into a Category 4 hurricane within a matter of only six hours. This is a unique opportunity uh, for us to observe a region that uh, heretofore has been unobserved. We really don't know what this environment looks like, and it's critically important because this is how the hurricane gets its energy. The Aerosonde will make continuous observations of the temperature, moisture, and wind structure of the near-surface hurricane environment, providing real-time detailed observations to NOAA forecasters. The science team's here at Key West Naval Air Station, and we're looking to stage the mission of flying into a hurricane. We're really excited about the possibilities of getting good data down below 3,000 feet where manned aircraft don't go. That's a really important area because that's the boundary layer. That's what fuels the hurricane. So we're looking to get some good information feed it live back to the National Hurricane Center and get some better modeling out of this.